Hi there, Decker Babcock here. Uh, trombone player out in the Denver, Colorado area. I play with a band here in town called Joe Smith and the Spicy Pickles, as well as uh, several other name bands around the country. Uh, I'm an artist for Dennis Wick products. I play the mouthpieces and their mutes. I also am an artist for BAC trombones. And the two together is really a good match. I really like it a lot. Um, today I wanted to talk about the mute that every student professional uh, hobbyist player should always have in their arsenal at any given time and that of course is the straight mute. Straight mute is probably um, the one you'll find in most people's bags at any given time and if not it should be in your bag. I really like the Dennis Wick mute. Um, I've played a lot of straight mutes over the years um, and nothing really compares to the playability, the intonation, and the, um, the ability to blend with a lot of different situations with the Dennis Wick mutes. And then to, you know, add a little extra to it, I also have the Brass Bottom Mute, which just adds a whole nother dynamic of options in sound and color. Again, playability. Um, using both of these interchangeably in jazz and classical music, um, I think you really can't go wrong with these at all. They're great mutes. Um, so without further ado, um, I will let you, the listener, make your own judgment as to what mute you think sounds best, and I highly recommend playing all the mutes. There's one other that I don't have, and that's the copper bottom mute. Um, these, uh, I highly recommend you go play these mutes, find the one that works for you, or get all three. That totally works too. We also like that. It's a good time. So starting with the standard aluminum mute, I'm just going to play a little bit of the St. Louis Blues. Really great mute, does well in that meaty middle register, does really good in the high register. The low register, you don't get any of, the, any of that like resistance kind of um, push to it. Uh, it's like blowing against a brick wall. I hate that. I love open, free blowing. These mutes really, really do the job. So next I'd like to move on to the uh, brass bottom mute. Slight change in tone color, slight change in playability, gives you a little bit more uh, a different set of ideas um, when, say, improvising melodies. Dennis Wick straight mute. Love it. <laughs> 